Uh, so my name's Alex Kirkpatrick. I'm co-managing partner of a business called Insight. We specialize in business to business uh, lead gen, so demand generation and a mixture of inbound and outbound marketing. Before we founded the company, I was working for one of the major market competitors and there was a, a real focus, and it seems straightforward, but it's something we still wrestle with today, uh, in the lead generation business that it, the more people you meet, the more frogs you kiss, uh, the more clients you win. And our, our thinking and thesis on that was that it just wasn't the case. And having worked at the bigger businesses, I saw evidence of the fact that a lot of people were meeting a lot of potential prospects, not having very valuable conversations, and not winning any work. We realised that thousands of pounds and thousands of hours were being wasted by really senior people sitting in rooms that they'd been begged into by telemarketers to really talk about things that the end prospect wasn't necessarily that interested in. So our approach to what had been seen as the proven way to generate business from other companies, from other businesses, was to turn it on its head, was to stop asking people if we could have half an hour of their time and start having much more involved grown up conversations about where their pain points and needs were and then allowing them to dictate how they wanted us to engage with them. And what we realised was if the value proposition, what you wanted to discuss was interesting enough, you wouldn't have to beg people to talk to you. They genuinely want to know. So we spent a lot more time with our clients, helping them understand not necessarily what made them unique, but what made them interesting. And then we thought about ways in which we could position that for our target audience, which is probably one of the most aggressively targeted to in the world. So yeah, I guess the, the leap was don't focus so much on the output you want from the person you're talking to. Focus much more on what you've got to offer that individual and why they should be interested in the first place. Uh, one of our clients had a particularly good case study working in social media for Facebook for Orange. And we started marketing their proposition and talking to brands. But what we quickly realised was that that demand, that interest was, um, was education in its nature. People weren't ready to necessarily buy what they were doing. They wanted to learn about it. So we were able to quite quickly tell the client, and it seems straightforward now, 60 people want to meet you. They want to learn about it. Have an event. Switch channels and focus on educating them. So you can either be very sales focused. We are expert in helping brands execute social media strategies. Do you want to buy it? Can we help you with that right now? Or you can be a bit more brand led. Educate people as to what to do and how to do it. They'll come to you as a trusted advisor. So what we found in using more of an event based process rather than just pure sales orientated, is the, is the agency grew exponentially over time as the perception of market was actually these are the guys who are good at this.